I joked that, you know, I grew up in Oxford and, and after I after I got got out of Oxford they banned kids. In those days you didn't have lacrosse and soccer. My father my father had soccer, but then like in nineteen fifty eight, the greatest game ever played when the Colts beat the Giants in sudden death overtime, soccer kind of went out the window and everybody just played football. Uh, previously it was basically just baseball, but then it became baseball and football. But um, we, had, we had good little league teams and, um, and, uh, and in 61 we won, in 62 we won the home run Baker uh, Little League Championship. Um, and we, we had an all-star team, of course, basically in Talbot County you had Easton Little League and, and then the Home Run Becker League was Cardova, two teams from St. Michael's, a Tillman team, Trap team, and an Oxford team. And we, we thought we were probably all going to end up being Major League Baseball players and we hardly have never beaten Easton. We went to where the Easton Elks Club is today and beat Easton 8-1. to one. And, uh, there was going to be no stopping and then we played Cambridge and Cordova and I think they beat us 25 to 5 so there was a major stop. That was the end of my baseball career basically. The people often equate the success of where you're from or where you grew up or where you were raised and really the ultimate experience was to grow up in, in a little town called Oxford, Maryland in the 